What up guys, today I'm playing The Last of Us and once again I'm doing a complete walkthrough of this game for you guys and I'm playing chapter 11 I'm doing the Firefly Lab and I'm doing the hospital so once you get to this part guys you just want to jump in this room right away and two guards are gonna walk past you and once they do you just want to jump through that window and take this first guy out Once you take him out, you just want to take out the next guy. Then you might want to walk over here, pick up that ammo. And then you just want to come back over here. Because there should be a guard walking down that middle hallway. And then once he walks past that wall or that window, so you don't see him, you just want to hop over and then hug this uh, window right here once he walks past you you just want to jump over the window or jump through the window and then take him out and then once you take him out you can make sure you pick up the, his gun and there should be another guy walking down this hallway as well so you just want to come back over here Again, once he walks past that window so you don't see him, jump through the window. And pretty much just do the same thing you just did. You want to take that guy out? And then what you could do at this point, you could look around through all the rooms if you want to do that and to see if there's anything around but eventually you want to come in here and just pick up uh, whatever's in here I think there's like some scissors you can pick up so make sure you pick those up and then you just want to go to this window over here and jump through it and then just walk over here now at this point guys if you wanted to like if you don't want to deal with these uh, guards um, I like to deal with them uh, just because you can get more ammo if you uh, take them out and I also just like to take everyone out wherever I'm at but you want to come over here and make sure there's not a guard like walking down this hallway sometimes there will be one and sometimes there won't be but like I was saying if you just walk over to the far left there will be a window and then that window will take you all the way down that hall and you can just avoid all these guys if you want to do that but if you don't want to do that, what you want to do is just stay over here because a guard should be coming into this room just uh, right about now in a second. So what you want to do is just hop over the wall, uh, stay behind this counter, and then once you can get behind them, uh, take them out. Right there I messed up. I wasn't trying to take them out with an axe. And then what you want to do is just stay behind this counter. Another guy should be walking down that right hallway, but again, always check your left side to make sure there's not a guy coming down that other hallway. But if you see a guy over here, what you want to do is just walk over here, stay by this window, and wait until he walks by. Once he does that, jump through the window and take him out. Now once you take this guy out, there should be only two more guys and those are the two guys that are just standing there at the end of that hallway. So you don't want to go this way. Um, right now I was just making sure there's no more guards uh, walking around. So you just want to backtrack and uh, head this way. And then you just want to come over here and just head to the far left. Um, again, I, I kind of take my time here for no reason. But anyways, you just want to walk over here and jump through this window. And maybe you want to go this way because I just didn't want to walk straight. I want to make sure that guy didn't see me as I walked over here. 
And then this is the window I was talking about that you can just jump through and avoid all these guys if you want to do that. But um, I say just take them out just because once you run down that hallway, like three guards will come from there. And you're going to have to kill them eventually. So I don't know if that will alert all the guards in this room or not. I don't know. I never tried it. But once you get over here what you could do or what you should do is just come over here take this guy out first and the other guy just won't notice you at all for whatever reason maybe he has like earplugs in or something and then just take him out again before you leave this area make sure you look around uh, just pick up whatever you want to pick up and then just leave I guess Alright, once you're done looking around, what you want to do is just head down this hallway. Now, if you have like a scissor bomb, maybe you could just place it like at the end of this hallway. Or you could just wait. I uh, probably would wait for that. You just want to run over here and hide behind this counter. Uh, three guy three uh, guards are going to run by. And then, I would say here, if you had a scissor bomb, you could just place it right here. And then, once you're walking down this hallway, a guy's going to burst through that door. So just get ready for him. Take him out and then you just want to run over here because that's going to alert the other guards. Or maybe you could just run through that doorway. I don't know. I never tried it. But now you just want to get ready for these guys and take them out. Again, there should be three of them. So that was one. So there's, there should be uh, two more you have to take out. So once you take those guys out again, search the uh, area and then just go through that door. Uh, but I'm going to skip ahead here guys. So once you get over here, um, I usually just sprint across this hallway. Um, I think that's the best way to do it without getting spotted I guess. And then you just want to come through here and go to this door over here. Now there will be a guard like right in front of you. So you want to wait until he walks towards the other window. Once he does that you just want to walk through these doors. Now if this guard is like walking towards that door at the time you're fine. You just want to keep walking up and just get behind him and take him out. And don't worry about the other guard because every time I try to take him out uh, I got spotted so don't even worry about him right away just take this guy out first once you take him out what you want to do is go to the room to the right of you or just straight in front of you you, you just want to keep going forward and once this guy walks away uh, what you want to do if you have a Molotov uh, you want to take it out And there should be like two guards like hiding behind the uh, the counter over there. So you just want to throw it right over here. Now once you take those two guys out, that's the doorway you have to get through. So And you notice that none of the guards are like running down here trying to see what's going on. So I don't know if you can just jump through that window and then head for that door. I don't know if you can go through it or not. You might be able to. You might as well try it. If you again, you don't want to deal with these guys because this is like the very end of the game. So uh, these are going to be like the last enemies you have to deal with. But if you don't want to risk it, what you could do is just do what I'm doing right here because I'm going to take everyone out anyways. Um, but again, if you want to be fast about it, because again, I'm trying to take everyone out like this quietly, I guess, even though there's really no point in it. Um, so if you don't want to take them out quietly, then uh, just use your weapons at this point. But once that guy walks over there, you want to make sure you take him out. 
And at this point, I think there's three guys left, or maybe two, uh, because again, there's one guy that I left in that room, and then there's a guy at the end of the hall, and then I think that's the third guy. But there might be two to three guys left. Uh, we'll find out in a second. But again, you just want to take your time. Uh, or if you don't, again, just uh, I, there should be only like two or three guys left. So you might as well use your weapons if you want to do that. But again, I just wanted to see if I could like just take everyone out like quietly. Uh, when I was playing this uh, this chapter, I guess. But again, like I said before, guys, this is the end of the end of the game, and this is the uh, last video I'm gonna make. But uh, I really enjoyed this game. I thought it was one of the best games I've played in a long time. I wish every game was like this. Um, you know, it's kind of sad that, you know, most game companies don't make games like this uh, with this kind of quality and this great storyline and the great characters. But, um, again, I really enjoyed this game, and I hope you guys enjoy it as well. And I hope these uh, videos uh, helped you out a little bit. But, again, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll check you guys out later.